Hi there, this is the SNES Drunk. Um, this is a little introduction video as to what I'd like to do with this channel. Um, you know, while my name is the SNES Drunk, obviously there will be a lot of Super Nintendo related material, and um, there will still be uh, some NES stuff on here as well, like old uh, videos I made way back in tech school, like 15 years ago. Uh, you can see it on the channel already with like Blades of Steel and Contra and that, that sort of stuff. Um, what I'd like to be able to do eventually um, is give some attention to some Super Nintendo games that aren't really talked about as much as the more classic games. You know, like everybody already knows about Mario, the you know Link to the Past, um, Star Fox, you know that kind of stuff. Um, but I'd like to talk about you know stuff like Cybernator, Legend of the Mystical Ninja, Lufia 2, the Top Gear series, uh, Rival Turf. All right, not Rival Turf. That game sucks. But um, I'd like to just shine a bit more insight into those games and why they're worth playing um, in 2013 or whatever year you happen to be watching this. Um, I do also want to talk about uh, a few of the games that everyone already knows about. You know, stuff like Chrono Trigger, which uh, is my personal favorite game ever, uh, Final Fantasy VI, uh, Turtles in Time, you know, Mega Man X series. Um, I, w what I'd like to do is not just review them, um, but I'd like to eliminate the whole, like, at the time aspect of it. Um, if that makes sense. I, I just want to go into how those games have held up in the past 20 years since the release and why they're still raved about. And what I mean by that is, um, you know, if, if you grew up with those with those games, um, it's obvious to you why those games are great. But if you're a kid and you've heard nothing about, you know, like, oh, so-and-so is great, you know, it's, it's almost like hearing about the Beatles constantly. You know, like, oh, the Beatles is amazing, amazing, amazing. It's so great, so great, so great. Can do no wrong, blah, blah, blah. And you just kind of instinctively avoid it because you've just heard so much hype about it. So I, I want to just strip away all the hype and just get into like the nuts and bolts as to why those games um, hold up as well as they do in this day and age, as opposed to you know the you know at the time and the whole classic aspect of it. I, I, if I, I don't know if any of that makes sense, but. <laughs> Um, there's also plenty of random stuff that's going to be on here, like my dog Clyde. Uh, he's a quirky yellow lab mix. Uh, he's very lazy, likes to sleep, and uh, yeah, I don't think he's paying attention to me right now. But um, anyway, uh, <laughs> there's also going to be you know lots of stuff with my dog and stuff like John Travolta dancing to death metal. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, that's uh, there might be some other uh, video game related stuff with like Dreamcast or Saturn or Genesis or whatever, but um, yeah, just mostly Super Nintendo junk. Um, and again, I am the SNES Drunk. Uh, subscribe if you want, uh, if you like what you see, and uh, I appreciate you coming to check this out.